I told you I said no. There's no. Caitlin. Oh, there she is. Caitlin, What's up, guys? welcome to the show. Thanks for having me on. Where are you? Where, where are you coming from? I'm back from? home. I'm back home in Des Moines. Came back to see my family like, for the weekend. Okay, like Des home home. Yeah, like home home. Not, home, yeah. home. Not at school. Not dorm room home. One of my first AU tournaments was at Drake. Isn't that in Des Moines? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to go to Drake games growing yeah. up all the time. I was like the team I always went to. Oh, you should have went there. Yeah, so how, how come you didn't go there? <laughs> uh, I, honestly, I just want to go to Power 5, but Coach Baranchek, who's at Oklahoma now, um, she coached there when I was getting recruited, and then she played at the same high school I went to, and then she played at Iowa, so uh, we were pretty good friends, but yeah, I, basically I just want to play to Power 5 more than anything. Yeah, and no, I have a question. So we all know you're at Iowa, obviously. We all know why you're at Iowa. Were there ever any other schools in the running? Yeah, um, my final three were Iowa, Iowa State, and Notre Dame. And really, it came down to Notre Dame and Iowa. I knew I wanted to be like fairly close to home, and Notre Dame like was still kind of in that driving distance, like six hours, um, but still like really high level basketball. Um, but like I, I don't know, Iowa was like perfect, like two hours away. Obviously, solid basketball, but at the same time, yeah. wasn't like a blue blood, and that's kind of what I was attracted to and really liked about yeah. it. And yeah, that's, that's kind of why I picked them in the end. Well, one of Sue's favorite schools is Iowa State, actually. Isn't oh, really? It? Yeah, isn't it? I didn't play in that game. <laughs> wow. Well, Diana, your favorite school game? must be Iowa then. Dang, yeah, go Hawkeyes. I actually always loved Iowa. You lost to Iowa? You're, no, I never lost. Oh. I never played Iowa. We never played Iowa. <laughs> we played I Iowa. So they Caitlin, set a record for most consecutive missed shots. Did they really? Yeah, so check your record books. <laughs> check the Hawkeye record books on that one. So did you, ta did you take every single visit? Yeah, basically. It's loud I, in here. I, t I didn't take a, an official to Iowa, but I visited like unofficially like three or four times just because it's so close. Like I didn't really need an official, but I took an official to Notre Dame. Um, I visited Texas, Oregon, Oregon State. Uh, those are like the main ones. So, <laughs> Kayla, what, like you took a couple unofficials, a couple official visits. What was your worst or most awkward recruiting story? Because we all have them. We all have them. Oh, man, that's hard. It feels like so long ago, too. Um, Tell me about it. <laughs> honestly, it I was don't even know if I have one. The year was 1997. <laughs> Do you have one? I have one. But, uh, I mean, uh, awkward? I mean, God, I don't know. I mean, I had a lot of, I don't remember half of them because I was having a good time, as we know. As we know. Um, no, I didn't have any weird ones. I mean, Coach Raymond pretty much lived at our house for like a month. That was weird. <laughs> He was having like T-bone steaks with Lily and Mario. He's just I'm like, who is this guy? Like, <laughs> my mom was like getting creeped out. Like, is he coming again this week? And I'm like, he's coming, mom. I don't yeah. want to tell you. Um, mine is that I visited Vanderbilt. Jim Foster, Coach Foster, was there. First day, he takes me to breakfast, spills coffee all over me. I mean, all over my my clothes. You know, I'm, I'm like a kid. I don't uh -huh. know who knows what I brought. I had corduroys and a, some dickies on. What I had on some overalls. I'm sure. I'm sure it was amazing. Whatever it was. <laughs> we were so he, swaggy but back like, then. But like he just oh swaggy. That's what we thought. Just, just swaggy back then. When Abercrombie and Fitch became a thing, Hollister we, we thrived. What happened with Hollister though? We thrived in our on our Abercrombie. Do you even know, Caitlin, what Abercrombie is? Yes, I do. I do. Would you be Would you be caught dead in it? <laughs> of course. Oh. No, I would be caught dead in it. Not now. Oh, oh, you would. Oh, take it back. Damn. Take it back, Caitlin. That was like. So tell us, like, style in college, right? Like, are you guys, are you guys focused on the clothes you're wearing to the game? Do you care? Like, what is it for you guys? And who we're playing? Maybe what channel we're on? Uh, um, oh, okay. Dog, they keep the good ones yeah. for the ESPN Honestly, yeah, the good ones for honestly, the a lot of honestly, a lot of time in the season, I'm, I'm so tired. I'm just wearing, like, joggers or sweatshirt. Honestly, most of the time. Roll out of bed, head to practice. I hear you on that. I'm, Sweats forever. I, so hold that thought, because we will be back. I mean, this speaks for itself. Obviously, welcome back. back. We've got some crazy range. Uh, Caitlin Clark. I mean, you didn't shoot like this in college. Uh, I wasn't allowed to. <laughs> uh, you know us, triangle offense. Oh, I'm, I'm very familiar with the triangle offense. 
I mean, her range is nuts, and the green light is even better. Well, I love you, it. When you play with the green light like that, yeah. you do things that you didn't think were possible. Right. Because anything is possible if you really think about it. I guess. I don't know. The step back she has. Uh, I mean, we talk about her all the time. Oh, These, she's here. She's here. Oh, wait. We're talking about her? <laughs> oh, God. These kids are doing things that we didn't start doing. We just, it wasn't, we just didn't practice no. these things. I mean, we talk about it all the time, Caitlin. You guys are just so advanced skill-wise skill -wise, yeah. in these things. And, uh, it's fun to watch. It's fun to watch, yeah. It's really fun to watch. So are you going to declare oh, yeah, for the absolutely. WNBA draft tonight or what? <laughs> That's funny. I mean, what no, more can I, you do honestly, in Iowa? What more can you do? Get to a final four, maybe? Final four. Break a That's scoring record. Oh, okay. Break a scoring record, maybe? So it was There's so hard more. to There's come to this more. game and watch in, in person. Yes. Yeah, so it, it was, was too hard obviously. to come watch this. Yeah. Sorry, I just cut you off. No, I mean, well, Minnesota's like. Interview. Minnesota's like four hours away, <laughs> too. So, like, obviously, it's really close. But, you know, yeah. I wish we were oh, playing we saw you rather the, than we saw you sitting in the stands. We yeah. saw you on the PJ bop over, bop back. <laughs> I like that. Hey, yeah. let me pick, let me pick up my trophy and go home and sleep in my bed. <laughs> I didn't win a <laughs> trophy. Nice. I didn't win any trophy. I was just there, but you didn't want the trophy. No, it was good. But it was cool. uh, it was the year was 2004, I believe. We lost in the Big East semifinal, and Coach Ramon made us go watch Villanova play Boston College in the finals. Oh, really? And I was oh, like, Wow, damn. you really ha you really hate us. Was it home? It was home. It was at the Harvard <laughs> Civic Center. Center. It was damn. terrible. It was terrible, Kaylin. So I don't blame you for not watching the game yeah. here live. No, I'm I guessing you guys all. want UConn to win it all. Is that who you got your money on? Well, I mean, I mean, <laughs> I mean, are you ever not going to cheer for Iowa? I mean, that's true. That's true. I feel like people don't realize, like, it's our alma mater. Yeah, yeah. I know. Like, we went there. <laughs> no, We're yeah. in this. Say. Like, that's, you know, you when we talk say about that, the, or even be in trouble. Exactly. Well, you know, but but that doesn't. Uh, we, we don't get by. Like, we'll give respect to teams that are better oh, or that course. are having great seasons. Like, of course. you know. Like any of these four teams can literally win the final four. Yeah. Like for as much as I want UConn to win it, like the best team will win tonight. So when you hate on UConn, you know, come and come and win it. That's all we can say. No, I think Ooh. the Stanford UConn game is going to be really close. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe so who, what's your picks? Us. Give us your picks. No pressure. Seriously. Um, obviously, I think South Carolina, obviously, in this game. But I think Louisville is going to make it close. I think, you know. They, just, they cause a lot of turnovers. Um, I try to box out the best they can. Um, other than that, I don't know. I think the, the late game tonight is going to be really interesting. I think it's going to come down to one of the last shots. But I think Stanford is really, really good. Obviously, they've got a lot of depth and um, defending yeah. national champs. But I think UConn's playing their best basketball right now, too. So that's always nice. I like that. You're, you're, you're right with me. We got the politically correct answers. I'll appreciate so, that. So, Kaylin, is the visiting locker room still pink? Yeah. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, they changed our that. Fo the, football one, the football one isn't. Ours isn't, though, for it's our, pink? our team. It's tiny, oh, okay. but the pink's supposed to, like, make you, like, calm and, like, tired or I don't know. Something, yeah. We walked I think we in, should so when we pink. played there... Yeah, when we played there 105 years ago, yeah. we walked in. We were like, what is going? It's literally all pink. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure it didn't bother you guys here too guys. much. Here comes the sixth Kardashian. <laughs> <laughs> Am I the seven? You know what? I think I'm going to paint Leo and Isla's room pink. You want to, to calm, calm, the, calm down, down a little bit and go to bed, kids. Hope so you have them sleep, Pen. I think, sleep, you, I think you know this, but someone is getting mic'd up right now to oh, join yeah. us. And when she does, I'm actually going to explain this to the group now. When she does, we're going to play a little game. Okay? Yeah. Are you down for like a little game? It's super easy. It's, Am it's, I the only one getting blindfolded though? No, 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 no. Yeah. No, not at all. No, so we're going we to we'll, blindfold Plum too. You could probably just close your okay. eyes if that's easier. Okay, yeah. Yeah, keep your I eyes closed. That's part better. of the game.